everyone, test to Pierre, and welcome back to the second game of the Stanley Cup playoffs. The next matchup has already been has already been delayed right now for the Western Conference as the game has already been timed and pushed back to as a fourth game for the Stars and Avalanche at Ball Arena. And then the last game is Seattle Kraken and Golden Knights here in Vegas. That will be the fourth game that will be played here right outside from the game of the Western Conference. This next matchup is about to go down as we got the Bolts, the T-Bolts, and Toronto Maple Leafs. These are guys are the tough ones to try to battle it out, but this is what everybody really wants. They want to fight to win. Now with this game, it's happening back again at Scalia Bank Arena. Right now the Maple Leafs have a one nothing lead in the series over the Bolts. But the question is, can the Bolts tie the game up and go right into game three where where the T-Bolts play home against the visiting team of the Leafs? We'll see what they can do to try to stay back in the game. Next up I will have is Spam along with OJ. And I say the rest of it now, I will have another look at the range and we will have is Nicole. I will see you, everybody, back here for the post-game show. And now, enjoy yourself for the next game. Get ready, get set, here we go. Enjoy, guys. Hello, everyone. Fan here, along with OJ. And this is the NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. It's the battle rematch of the Bolts and the Leafs back at Stadia Bank Arena in Game 2. And with the Bolts win, we start now. The courtesy lineup is being as follows. We have is Ryan O'Reilly. Then we have is Tavares. From the angle, we have is Mitchell Marner. Then it's Austin Meadows. And then we have is Bunting. And finally, the goaltender for the Leafs is Samsonov. Samsonov was able to try to go with that one here. As I noticed here before, he got a bunch of saves here on the first star of the game. He was very well trying to pick up his run. The motion was great, but it's not enough to try to like keep it over the outside of the range and try to keep it over it again. However it did turn out, it really has to be on here just they did. On the other side we have his brother Sean. Then it's Braden Point. Then we have his headman. Across the other angle is Kucherov. And we have a lap along the other hand here is, is Steven Stamkos. And finally, the goaltender, the back again, is Vasilevsky. Vasilevsky was able to go with the good floaters of the game. He made a great save to go with the stop. And they all loved him too. Now he's proven to be, to be wrong though, that Vasilevsky got tricked up in the first game, and it was never to be clear enough at that point to try to stop the run. It is very hard to try to stop the pressure to go back in again. Very tough one to keep an eyes on. Sorelli with the puck. Gives the backboard over to Killorn. Gives over to Hagel. To Perbix. Perbix over to Shankachev. With the shot! Rebound point! Stopped by Sansonat. Perbix with the recover. John Crooks got the puck here as oh, Sorelli with the steal. And they don't have a much to play on that one to go with the takeaway. Rolando with the puck, right back over to Holt. Swings back to Jankrock. Puck taken away here as Sorelli has the puck. He fires the puck out and over to Maroon. Maroon to Colton. Puck carried out. Cole will have to try to fix it from the deck to regroup again. Colton with the puck. Battle along the boards. Cernax with the puck. Call back over to Cole. With Cole shot. Blocks away by the defender. Call back over to Cernax. One timer. Cole. Stopped by Samsonov. Samsonov was able to keep that one out of here for good. When the player was already gaining weight, he has to try to stick it up to himself to show his to show his roots. To try to work his way around. So he has to call and Buck carries out. 
and it will have to call icing here as it's called on Tampa Bay Bolts. With the top for release mints, here we have on the side is Nickel. The cross on back the angle here, as we're all calling for, one of the third eyes of this mention is Mitchell Marner. Now, for this player of this game, he was never able to play with his, most of his team to try to keep him right on the side. For his most convenience, he may have a lot of it to go right from in between from, from the set of the stage. For Austin, Mar for Austin Meadows, may have a lot of it to go with the, with the shots to get right back into it. He's not really well impressed of how he's going to keep it over. On the other side right now is, is Kucherov. His puck goes with the one tee. He makes that one a good timing to get right into here. His moment was turning out great, but a lot of it has turned out to be one way to another. It may not be enough, though, to go right from here. I'll try to keep an eye on here for an update just around the corner. Guys, back to you. Harry with the puck, passed over again, back to Furbix. Furbix, back to the answer call. That's pass taken away by Marna. Lundgren up over to Bunting. Furby! Oh, wow! That's a little hit on a hit collision. Bolts was going striking. That's hard. Sam Coast. Shot stopped made by Samsonov. Furbix to Shagrovich. With the shot, decided to go for deep, but it's Samsonov with the stop. Sam Coast shot. Rebound! Oh, put it in the back. We'll stop the play here with just 11.34 to go in the first period. The score is even. Now they're ready to take the face off right from the outside and the inside. Point wins the face off. Point recovers it. Back to Stamkos, back over to Point. Taking a shot. Rebound, Stamkos. In the back of a net. Backhand shot. Rebound in front. Try to battle along on the goaltender. We'll have to stop in the play here as Stamkos couldn't try to save it. That most of the play was very aggressive, but because of this one was very tight. The battle of this range was not able to pick up another one. It's going to be very tricky to try to get that puck back in the net and try to beat from the goalie. Oh, Holmberg didn't have it all. Angle, back over to Sorelli. And Bogusan will have to try to regroup the puck here from outside. Here's Hagel. Hagel trying to go with the, with the motion. Simmons goes right back over to Holmberg. Pass to Aston Rees. Rees! Puck was taken away. Killer pass goes over to Sorelli. Sorelli helps the puck from here. Go with the backhand! Stop by Sensenov! Samson now still going. I can't believe it. He's going to go right into the game and try to tell the Bolts to don't get over it. Nylander. Oh, that's a little hit on that course. Kucherov with the puck. Now back to Stankos. With the one T. Hit the toe and back over again to Kucherov. Sarnax to call. Call with the stick play. Kucherov saves it. Sorenox back over to Cole. Cole lifts the stamp post. So early shot. Kucherov trying to hit the back, but it's stopped again right behind the net. Cole trying to stop one. Sorenox recovers it. Sorenox. Nylander with a shot. Stamp and goes right around the net. Nylander in trouble. Bellamar with the pot. Gives it cold. Shot. Rebound. Hurry shot. Al Samson. What a beauty play. <laughs> oh, man. That Samson help was very quick. That has to stop the play to go with the motion. A lot of oohs and ahs moments out there. We're going to be here all night to give up a call. Cernax over to Perry. Double man carries it out. Lost his stick and we'll have to replace a new one. Riley in the corner. Anderson. Oh, Cole was swapping out of here. And Mr. Cobb. Puck gets thrown away. Now Cole with the puck. Gives it to Cernax. Back to Paul. Now Shikov over to Cernax. To Cole. 
Cole carries offside as this one comes into a face off coming up. Players are set, ready to take the face off. The score is still even, no scores yet. Now with the win, here's Brink. Brody DeMarner. With the block of a shot. That's stopped by Vasilevsky. Paul recovers the puck over to Colton. With the fast break, 2 1! Hadman! The timing is off, and Samsonov has to recover it with a save. Players are set, ready to take the face off. Score is still still sat zeros. Nothing on the board. Paul over to Brother Sean. Gives it to Hedman. Hedman trying to go with the shot. Plus save me by Samsonov. Sand it right over to Bundy. Taking away again. Maroon right back the other way. Battle on a loose puck. Paul has it back. Missed the firing pass over, and Bunny will have to recover it. Lower green right back to outside, into inside the territory for the bolts. Heaven try to watch him. Deflected it off the pad. That goes right back over to Paul. 420 seconds to go. Still need to find a score right away. Heaven shot. We check it off again by Santanov. Here's Paul, back to Kemp, trying to regroup it, block the pass, and it will clear the puck down the other end. All the way over to Kemp. Battling for the loose puck, recovered again. Back over again, and fell. The kill on shot, stopped again by Samsonov. He's already been quaking alone. He was going for the quick reaction. Oh boy, I have to say this. I gotta get that call, that puck right back before he comes in. East game one appearance has turned out to be just like he did, but for the second game, has to be the same thing just like that. And Stamkos, he carries in the offset offense and it was outside as the puck was entering in the offense zone. Now the players are ready to take their own time in the offense zone and neutral zone. Now they're back in the win. Sergeyev goes right back over to Forbix. He gives it off to Point. Point within in the range. Try to recover. Good drive! Wow, no penalty called on Toronto! They can't keep it out! Not really a sign, but this was not happening like that. Kucherov would have got that goal. Not a very good sign. He has to get it right from here. With the shot, rebound! Nowhere to be found. Engvall with the puck. Try to back over to Kemp. With the Engvall! And shot stopped here by Vasilevsky. Namstikov. Firing the puck over to Killorn. Riley getting a little bit bumped up here. Burbick's up to Cole. Stick clicked it, but still keeps it on. Just one minute left to play in the first period. Balabar! Trying to give it over to Nemsikov, but it was off wide. Here's Cole. Shot! Stopped again. Balabar! With the wraparound! Deflected off again. They're trying to get over this one here. They need to get somebody to help. Here's Cole. Shot! Rebound! Oh man, two tank stop! Oh, they're not going to count that one in there because he was in the crease set. Watch this play. You see what it did? That was the shot that looks like that Pierre was able to hit it in. But he was in the crease set. That will not affect the goal to pick a play. After the ref's call, it's no goal. Back to a face off. Just under 10 seconds. Paul with the win. Over to Colton. Nylander will try to hang on. And the puck give it to Cernax. So that ends the first period. Great tight stop run for Samsonov. We'll get the second period underway shortly after this. 
second period about to begin. No score for the first period, but now let's find out what happens in the second period. Now we resume the play. Here's Riley, and as their team was taking a look at it, he was not able to try to keep his best on his range with the St. Louis Blues. As the NHL contracted him to go with a different team to Toronto Maple Leafs. Yeah, he was really into that one because their team is like, they're going to need some power up to get over this one because they're watching out is the Bolts. That's what the players do. They can't leave it up there alone. The play continues. Right now, here's Hedman to Bogoshan. Try not to fuck it in there. Point stopped by again by Samsonov. The close call. Now, here's Marner. Hucked away. Here's Kucherov. Try to hit the run. Oh, move around. Shot. It is blocked up in front. Good stop here by a defenseman of the hockey player. Here's Marner. Lost the puck. In behind the net. Pucks broke it up. Here's Kucherov. Kucherov fighting for the battle. Now gives it back over to Bogoshan. Keeps it carried the puck into around as Point recovers it. Stamkos right to Forbix. With the shot, Killorn! It's blocked up! Point recovers it now. With Killorn! That's a good stop made by Marner. Marner was trying to go right in there. He has to get over it and try to stop him down. Forbix back over again to Killorn. Killorn shot! Put the wrap around! That shot went wide. Killorn! No interference call. Killorn put a deflection in there, no shot made as it went to wait and out. Kerfoot, try to recover the puck. In the corner, Kerfoot lost it. Shajkovic, back over to Sorelli. Sorelli, pass over to Killorn. Pass to Hegel! Shot is stopped by Samsonov. Samsonov was able to try to keep him loose out there. Stop him A as Cernax recovers it. Maroon in the middle. Give a pass over to Hegel. Sure out! And Samsonov, one time shot, won't be enough with the tic tac toe movement. Players are set, ready to take the face off in. Once again, the score is still nothing in the game as they would have called the rep the challenge shot, but it was too late as it was a no goal. That was definitely a better play to give that run because the player of that one to parry was in the crease, not able to pick up the run. Gordano outside. Maroon Anna now gives it to John Ox. Oh, wow, the bang out. Killer was out there just going right away. Can't just go right from to here. The player was like, oh wow, that was better, better. Offside. Maroon went too far and he should have had to stop it right from the blue line. The offside is whistled and now the faceoff is coming up here for the for the play. Lilgen. Mamsikov. What a stop. Now we're one on one for the move! Backhand to Samsonov stop again. There's just going to be a heavy one out there. If he was looking over it, he would have been stopping right away. Players are set, ready to take the face off. And right now, the moment is going in quick. In between by the two, they're going right back to it now. Cole thinks the puck over to Napsikov. Sornax has it. He fires the fucking deep. Hooked away. We covered it up. Now back to Perry, back over to Sanko Crab. Sergachev. To Sornax. Shot! What? Rebound up! No play made here as Samsonov picks up a save. And here's Bellamar. Bellamar, move! The road back scores! Bellamar! A first goal for the playoffs in game two. Get a one nothing lead. That was a quick attack, but why not run around it? He did find room. 
and he was right in the squeeze from the corner. What a play for Bellowar. The Colts are on the board for the second period, and they got one nothing lead over the Leafs. Now they have to find another way to go in now. Paul recovers the puck. Looking bound, Colton and Gap get the fleck it up again, and Angbell and battling along the board. Here's Anderson, playing out. Colton, moving the puck out of here as Circa Chef back over to Perix. To Paul. Paul in the move. Try to give it a sandwich. Paul outside. Colton, that stop by Samsonov. The play was going back down with just under 12 minutes, 11.51 to go. Now the wing comes in, Brody in the corner. Riley in back over to Bunting. Bunting moving the offense zone, and Kucherov takes it over. The bolts are in the offense zone. This is a stop coast. Oh, that took off. What a great save me by Samsonov. Riley back over to Bunting. Bunting to Marner. Back to Tavares. Tavares in the center. Give it off to Marner. Bulge out of here. And that's going to be a hurt one for making painful to Tavares. Well, they should never have that penalty because that was definitely clean for the Bolts. They never received a penalty out there. They have never got any day. Bogashan shot, the left is stopped. I meant to Bogashan. Rebound again. Oh wow, that's a bigger stop. I meant right in the middle. And that one's getting deflected off again. Marner battling along the board. Here's point shot, stopped again by Samsonov. That play was very tough. Wow, Samsonov can't believe it and he was going to save it again. He's behind the net. We'll have to face the group. Full attacker. Fervix the point. Now over to Killorn. With a pass. Oh, wow, Samsonov really got away. Killorn. Sergachev to Fervix. Fervix to Sergachev. Gives it the point. Battling the puck along the board. Point recovers back to Sergachev. Burbix gives the Kalorn. Angle shot would have gone in, but it was given off to the wrong angle. The Leafs are in offense to kick up their run. An easy textbook save here by Vasilevsky. Pulls got it down here in the offense on their side. Toronto moving back into the offense zone. Give to the jerk rock. Stop again by Vasilevsky. Vasilevsky was still able to hold on tight. We're going to have the control of this to keep up this run with a wild save. Now it's the cop. Stop again. Kerfoot with the puck over to, to, to Giorondo. Playing the puck up. Cernak's got it now. Over Killorn. And Bellamar again, 2 on 1. Nemsikov, blocked out by a defender. They're all over it now. The Leafs wants to get power. They said, fall back, fall back. That's what they have to do to try to regroup. Blocked again, Samsonov. Oh, good save, me. Wow, that's a great play here for Samsonov to try to keep up this run. Moment is taking it forever time. They have to get over. Players are set right now with the face-off. Tampa Bay in front if one nothing over the Toronto Maple Leafs. Aston Reeves with the puck under six minutes to go. Push shot in the way. It's Maroon's turn. Jordana to Holmberg. With the middle! Rebound! Two-time stop. As unless he's going to hold on with just under 5.30 to go. They're both having a little aggressive out there. Easy up. They're going to need to try to fix that one here with a better motion. Oh, big stop by Colton. Aston Reese who covers it. Bring the puck up here without being called offside. Maroon has it now. 
trying to stop this one. With a move, Acid Breeze recovers it. But I know, back over to Simmons. Simmons has it now. Pump check away by Headman. Puck flies out. Now Sandin has the puck. He comes over to Holmberg. Holmberg trying to stay steady inside the offense zone. Bogosian right over again to Stamkos. Stamkos right to the corner. More timer stopped by Samsonov. Logren right back to it now over to Kemp. Kemp trying to move it over to Aston Reeves. Aston Reeves into the middle with a shot. It's stopped by Vesilevsky. Stamkos. Bogosian has the puck. We try to recover it from here to point. Back around it, and Lil Grant has the puck. Back to Aston Reeves. Race over to Sander. Under three minutes to go in the third, in the second period, it's a one nothing game. They're still up to it, run. They have to keep on going to go fight for fighting. Kucherov in the corner. Pat, pat, pass. Sorelli with the puck. Neither green group offside with the call. Furbex right over back over to Hagel. In the middle, Furbex one time shot stopped by Samsonov. What a great look, but not a great uh, goal to pick it up for Furbex. Well, that pass was going to be in there, almost. Because of this one, he's given up the right man advantage to try to hold on to it now and try to go with a better angle. That was tough to try to hit the runner. Here's Riley back over to Birdie. Back to egg ball. We're winding down to 90 seconds. It's a one nothing lead for the Bolts. To Hagel. With the shot. Rebound. Kalorn not in time. That is stopped by Samsonov with only 1.11 to go. Now with the win, here's Brody to Riley. Bellarmine recovers it. Puck right around it. Just in our minute to play in the first period. Now Chicago with the shot. Rebounded again as that goes off by Samsonov. Tavier's back to Riley. Riley searching it around. With the puck, stopped by Bezalevsky. Bezalevsky was able to try to keep it clear to go right back towards it again. Not really well enough, but they gotta get over it. Now Sakov with the two on one. Rebounded front. No deflection here for the bolts. That went off target. And that ends the second period. Only one period to go. As for Bellamar, got a good tight range to hit the goal. One nothing, bolts. Third period next after this. And we are ready. The third period is on the line, ready for her to play. Bolts in the lead with 1-0. They have a lot of range attacking out there with a lot of forcement. With the motion, it's going to be tough. Hurts are up! Oh, Samson off with the save. Good stop here for the defensive to try to stop the run. That's really going to be very hard because of that one, Kucherov was nowhere to be found. He hasn't stopped the puck here for most of the time. And he didn't really have it all like he did. Samkos! Oh, wow. Point back over to it again. Bunting to Marner. Marner sets it back to Bunting. Shot! Pat saved here by Vasilevsky. To Tavares! Oh, the put back! Stopped again by Vasilevsky. He's already been going way, way far. Really going to be a tough one to try to keep up with the range with a rebound. After the outside this whistle, it is one nothing Tampa Bay. So Riley wins the faceoff. Picks it up by over Riley. Riley trying to scoop back over to Kerfoot. Kerfoot flings the puck up again. And that is out of reach. 
Now it's back over to Sekachev. Killarn back over to Hagel. Back in the neutral zone, the offense zone for the belts. More time for Sekachev. That deflected off of Kerfoot. Killarn's got it now, back in the offense zone. Burbix. Sugarchev blocked the shot in front. Wow, that's a great stop. That is a tough one to try to go on the street. The most of the words really has never caught on. They have to keep it going. Sugarchev, curveball. Oh, Vasilevsky would have got that one here. Got a piece of it and keeps it out of the net. Very tough to go with the inbound. Might need to keep that one going if he can try to keep it longer out there. Second tap outside. Just back to Cernax. Back to Circuit Chap. To Killorn. Chopper left. Rebound. Colton stop beer again by Samsonov. Samsonov's still looking good. Looking comfortable. Killorn. Back to Paul on a tricky pass. That was a little bit fling off. The fling off, the batter passes, I mean that could be hard. Colton shot. Into left, ball, rebound, stop again by Samsonov. Jan Krog again, back on Cernax with a one on one. Gets banged up in the corner of the wall. Scores! Jan Krog, we are tied. Jack Crox already had gotten it right around again. The moment was going to be putting it back in again. That was hard. And now, back in third period, with one, that is why they've got to go for it. Stop again by Veselevsky. With a stop and play inbound, the tie a game. Releases for Toronto and the Bolts. As for now, it turns out to be the offense chanting for the Leafs to take out the Bolts. Yeah, the Bolts are not very really well team. They're like an enemy rivals. They've already won the Stanley Cup like two times. But for now, they're trying to get rid of it. And the Bolts don't really want it. And people are being bored here by the Bolts. They want to see them again. If they get, and we don't know the longest history of the season was being made because the moment really doesn't happen to be a occurrence out there. So that's why they don't want to do this again. Oh, one-time shot again. Sansing off with a stop. Back to Bukashan. Over to Bellamar. Bukashan back to Hedman over again. Shooting from the right. Then go down to with that takeaway. Find the puck up again. Hedman trying to make new changes here with the offense to try to pick up the run. No play on that one. Brody back over to Camp. Camp trying to hold on. Hold the way. Point with it now. Blank in range. Kucherov. Will shot. Scores. Back in the lead with Kucherov. And they're up on that board. Oh, wow. Fans were disliking Kucherov. That one time goal was putting up a revenge. You saw that Kucherov was able to go right around the back. With that goal, turned out to be a takeaway. Kucherov was able to pick up his goal on this moment, and that was really hard to try to fix it from the deck. Now this happened to be one of them to go right in between the Kucherov score to, uh, to Bunning score to tie the game. And now they're back up in the lead. We'll keep an eye on here for Kucherov to try to hit the deck on the run. Back to you guys. And apparently range is up here for Toronto. Kucherov, and we got a stop whistle in play. This one will have to call for a slash. That goes to Mitchell Marner. Now the fans are disliking a call. They cannot believe what Marner did. Frustrated. Wow, very on a bad, bad behavior. It's putting up a nightmare. Power play coming up for the Bolts. Nikita Kucherov was able to pick up his one T motion to pick up his timing. The motion point blank was able to pick up his run to go with a better shot. The score is useless. 
He could try to hit the defender right and around the target to go right from head to head blank sets. I'll keep an eye on Kucherov with another update with the goal. And as for the last game, he's got a hat trick. Back to you guys. Back over to Sergachev. No penalty regained on Toronto. Pro checked, recovered by Riley. He flames the puck. Now Sergachev has the puck. Passing down 10.30 to go in the third period, almost down to a mid-period. Back to offense. With Sergachev! Good stop made by Samsonov. Pull him back over. Axton Rays picks it over to half perfect. Trying to clear it out. Passing the midway period in the third. Killorn with the puck. He rolls back over to Perry. To Paul! Whoa, one time shot stopped by Samsonov. We'll stop the play with 9.42 to go. Now with another call, Steven Stamkos. He has one key to release his shot ability. The moment he gives him all, he gives him a good slap shot to go with the pass and one time shot. This motion is definitely what he goes for. I'll keep an eye on Steven Stamkos. If he gets a goal, to pick it up away. Back to you guys. Power play is over for the Bolts. As no plays for the power play goal turn out to be ahead. That really has to turn out because that's a very hard one to try to lease to keep out the pressure. Motion is not that real, but it really does have turned out. Everybody's getting tired. You're trying to wait for the energy to pick up the run. I mean, it really has to turn things up very hard to carry it out. Now with the place, we have a call here for Nickel. Vasilevsky has it all with the control of his thing that go with the play and the puck with a wild save. His motion turns out to be wild on the, on the defenses with his good eye on the puck. And for Mitchell Mariner, able to have his third eye and go right for the players to go with the head of the time. Motion is hard. Not to confuse with better players like Sebastian Ajo has done. In this player of this motion, you will try to keep a third eye for the deck to go right from here. I'll be keeping an eye on the players here, around along with Marner and Vasilevsky. Guys, back to you. No penalty called on Toronto. And Sorrell scores! Sorelli! They stand it now, 3-1. Sir Raleigh, able to back it out. He says, okay, I got this one. And he had to put that one in there to pick up with the goal. Now they're on their feet for the bolts to tie the game. Sir Raleigh wins the faceoff. Back in the middle. Sir Raleigh! Hang on! Blocked it, say Lord! Oh, wow! Back-to-back -back switch and the Fleets are disregarding it. They are just disliking the call. Oh man, the fans are not really happy at all because of Killorn. He got it back. That was Killorn, a better play than ever to pick up over the Bolts with another extension to tie the series. It looks like they're ready for Game 3 at their home in MLI, Amali Arena to get ready for the face-off in game three and four. Here's Ben Bunting over to Paul. Paul passing along the neutral zone to offense zone. Now Logren. Logren back over the offense zone to neutral to Bunting. With a move, Paul takes it away. Cole back outside right over to Cernax and back to Maroon. Maroon can't find anybody. Scoop up along the board by Sanding. Sanding to Lundgren. Bunning back in the offense zone. Twerty put for the play. To Veer shot. Excuse me. Cernax recovers the puck over to Maroon. Maroon. Passing the puck over back to Paul. Paul with the range. Rebound in front. Stopped again by Stamkos. Sorry. Samsonov. And back into the offense zone. 
So the chat, as it goes back with a bad pass. Not really open look. The feeling was out of tower vault with the run and try to pick up their screen on the, the on the offense to try to hit the run and go back with the run. That has to give somebody else a shot. Namstakov to Sergan Sergachev. Egg bell with the puck. On Fairbix with the shot. Stop by Vasilevsky. Oh wow. Vasilevsky is going to be heading in there to win the game. Stop again by Vasilevsky. Egg bell shot. Scores! Back down by two, with 3.50 left to go. They still have a little bit more time. If they can get a goal, they can put it back in there. Engvall, able to show what his backhand can be. The moment just stops it all. When he gets a puck here, he's able to try to pick up a backhand. And he says, I have this one, I'm going to try it a different way. And he has it all down to give him up a run. He's doing really well out there, guys. Just keeping it on the pride on run. Guys, back to you. Stamkos back outside with a one shot. It's blocked up a defender. Point blocked again. Kucherov, no recover here. We're down now back to Kirfa. They're back over it again. Jack Krog. Try to give it to Kirfa. The shot stopped by Vasilevsky. Stopping the play with 2.34 to go in the third period. For the next game, we will be in the Western Conference to find the next one in. As the next one will occur, it will be the Stars and Avalanche here at Ball Arena. Following along with the fourth and last game of the Game 2 of the Part 1, I'm sorry, Day 1, I should call that one here, will be the Kraken and Knights at t Arena after the Avalanche for Stars game in Game 2. Now back again is Hall. Jan Kroc back with the puck. With the shot! Stopped by Vasilevsky. Vasilevsky's still on a good motion. It looks like they're going to give a win in Game 2 for the Bolts to try to pick up the run. Sugar Chat back over again. Jocularn! Rebound again by Samsonov. So rally back to Phobix. Hagel right with the puck. Go up with the run. Oh, stopped and shot. Gillorm with the puck. Now back to Sergachev. Over to Phobix. Phobix. Oh, no penalty call on that one. That is going to be a very hard on the team. And now they're losing time. While the time is running down, now they're ready for the extra man skater on. Gordano. 40 stars down by one and Brody got a first goal in the power of the playoffs. Easy call, easy come. Brody ready to go. The Leafs are down by one. They're trying to stop one big here as Velasilevsky got blinded by a defender. Now they're ready to go with another extra man on. Here's Rice. Stop again. Perry. Four fourth in. Almost went in. I see. We'll be whistled here on Tampa Bay with 35 seconds to go. Players are coming down to the wire. With a 4-3 game, they're trying to come back and tie it. If they get an next goal, we are going to overtime. Barry lost the puck. Holmberg up. Mortar! Shot stopped by Vasilevsky. Vasilevsky's going to hold the puck here with under 30 seconds to play in the third period. Now with the shot ready to get back in the action. 4-3. Point with the puck. Brody with the puck. Trying to go with the man advantage, but not this time. Stamkos will try to run away and put it in the net. Stamkos wins the game with the Bolts tying the series up here in 1-1. And that's what Steven Stamkos did to finish the game off strong. Well, that was it. They all they had, that was all they could do to try to beat the game out of it. And now, they have nowhere to be found. Last possession, Riley, Aston Reyes, Simmons, 
and they won't pick him up here. And that will end the game. The Bolts wins the second game over the Leafs. A great score in between by Stamkos, Braden Point, Alex Killorn, and Bellamar. Well, a fantastic time here in Toronto. A disappointing run, but the Bolts made it back in in time. I know they do. They will give that one a good run to get back into the action play. So along with me, Fan and OJ, along with Nico, this has been a presentation of the Stanley Cup Playoffs. Now to close the game with three stars, we go to Test 2. Thank you for joining with us, and see you next time. Good night, everyone. Alright there, Fan, thank you very much. Now time for the free star plays of the game. Starting off with number three, Zach Bogoshan. Two assists and two hits turned out to be just like he was going to do. And with that play, it did turn out right. Second star is Anthony Chirelli. Finally have a goal in peace. And with the one assist, he got that in. And the first star goes out to Samsonov. Only Samsonov really got 57 saves and turned out to be excellent in the first and second period with the third. But however, the things got in the way with Bellamar's score with a breakaway chain in the second period. Then it was happening here before with the third period. A lot of saves here coming inbound. With the battle of the lounge, it turned out to be again as they get a goal and finally tie the game up. And then the other hand was turning out to be a breakaway chain. All around it, the puck, shot, rebound, and deflect. And now, this is what happens. Sorelli had that shot and made that goal. That was all he had taken, right from here. Plus, the other goal that turned out to be was Killorn that turned out to be just like he did. And that was the goal that he was ever going to do to give that one a good shot. And another one, backhand, stopped the shot, and thanks to Killorn back again to do with the run. And the finishing of the goal was turning to be Steven Stamkos. After a goal made here for the Leafs, twos in a row, they're trying to get right back into this. Not really well enough in an occasion at least. Well, they could definitely try to do that one again with much more, as Bunning makes that one a goal. Brody, I should bet. And with that one here with Stamkos, it just really has to happen the end of the game. And with only the power play, a penalty miss. No power play goals for the... Bolts, they do not need one here, they only need the time on attacks. 12 of 6 to 4 of 1, and total shots with 62 to 33. 15 hits for the Bolts. Wow, they're swiping their crazy and whip their butts off. <laughs> I don't mean literally, but it's not like when they're actually doing it. So, just don't try to mess it, okay? And with that one, thank you for watching. And as always, peace out everyone for a while as the NHL on Stanley Cup playoffs of the 8 sports style. This is Test Tube, and if you're tuning in to the third game, we have Stars and Avalanche coming up soon here on Summit Beats. So don't leave your seats out there because we got more games coming. Following along with the Pacific team of the Kraken and the Knights at T-Mobile Arena. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. If you already have watched it, make sure to like it and post a comment if you have anything to say. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you all next time. Goodbye, guys, and have a good night in Toronto. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.